Welcome to the Thermal Scientific Insight Software Educational Series. These videos introduce you to the functionality of Insight Software and demonstrate commonly performed applications. Available in your home language, Insight Software enables you to reach answers consistently and with unprecedented speed by maximizing the use of your Thermal Scientific Evolution 200 series spectrophotometer. It is an effective solution for achieving regulatory compliance or to accelerate your research. In this video, we will review the basic steps for setting up a fixed wavelength measurement. A fixed application would be used when you need to measure at one or more specific wavelengths. Insight software includes a comprehensive help system covering everything you need to be successful with both Insight software and the Evolution 200 series spectrophotometer. An introduction video is available. We recommend getting acquainted with the help system as your first step. The help system is available from the help menu or by pressing F1 for most Insight screens. Setting up a fixed wavelength measurement. From the home screen, click the Fixed Application button. The Fixed Settings window has four tabs. Measurement, Instrument, Accessories, and Samples. Beginning with the Measurement tab, you may enter a method template description in the description box. The Instrument tab is where you will select your variables for the fixed measurement. Selecting the data mode, absorbance is the most common, percent transmittance, reflectance, and multiple log calculations are additional options. Integration time is how long the system acquires and averages data at each measured wavelength. Increasing the integration time improves the signal to noise ratio. For better results, customers typically find 0.5 to 1 second integration times to be adequate. Selecting the bandwidth. This is fixed at 1 nanometer on the Evolution 201 spectrophotometer. 2 nanometers is recommended for the Evolution 220 or 260 bio spectrophotometers. For more information on bandwidth options, please visit Insight Help. Results mode determines how results are calculated and displayed. The choices offered satisfy the needs of most methods. Normal generates results in the units specified in the data setting. For more options, please refer to the help system within the Insight software package. Accessories tab. The available parameters depend on the installed accessories. Accessories will be reviewed in another video. For this experiment, we are using a single cuvette to measure the concentration of green food coloring. The Samples tab. Enter the number of samples for your experiment. In addition, you can establish the base name for samples being measured. For example, the base name we will use is dye. The samples in this measurement will be dye 1, dye 2, die three, and die four. We are now ready to take our measurements. Click the green measure button. The measure fixed window is displayed along with a loading guide. Now place your blank in the light beam, close the cover on the instrument and click OK to start the measurement. After the blank is measured, the confirmed sample list box appears. At this time, you may make a change to the number of samples or simply verify the sample list and click Continue. The loading guide appears again and exhibits the information for the next sample. Place a sample in the light beam and click OK. Repeat for each additional sample. Creating a report within the Insight software is quite simple. To view and organize your results for reporting, click Reports located in the lower left-hand side of the screen. To customize the scale of the graph, click the double arrow button at the bottom right of your screen. Use the directional arrows to expand or contract 
the absorbance and wavelength scales so that all data points are clearly visible. In this example, we are displaying all three measurements. Measurement labels default to a vertical orientation. To rotate the measurement labels, hover over the measurement, right click and choose rotate. Repeat for each measurement if desired. Additional customization options are available under the Reportable Data and Layout tabs. Reportable Data enables you to customize the columns that will be shown within your report. Under Layout, you may format and customize your report by including a title, subtitle, choosing which data will be shown, such as graphs and report notes. The print preview screen will update with each selection that you make. Under the menu bar, you will find options to preview, print, or export your report to a USB stick or PC. Thank you for reviewing the basic steps for setting up a fixed wavelength measurement. Please visit us again to view additional videos in this educational series.